Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to week number five of season one of the Lions Den League. It is the midway point, at least after this week. And yeah, it's been going quite solidly so far. I finished sixth, eighth, third, and fifth in the first four weeks, which is very solid. Hoping to keep that up this week. Overall standings look like this, although they're not completely um, accurate because I've played four weeks and everyone else has played five kind of thing. But um, I think I'm at least top five, maybe top three uh, at the moment, but hopefully we can um, keep up the momentum here. So uh, this week we have the moving map, uh, east, I thought you said yeast. I don't know what this means or like what that, like <laughs> I don't know what that means is gonna be in the map, but I guess we'll find out. And um, yeah, let's let's get it going. All right, starting okay. Prospection Brewery looks like I guess South Africa. Um, this looks like some kind of like industrial area here. Maybe going the opposite way from where we were facing at the start is not a smart idea. Um, so if this sign says nothing, I might just go back prospect and oh, there is stuff. Okay, we have the N2 towards Durban. Is that all we get? This it's got to go another direction, doesn't it? Okay, well, prospect and okay, so it is a town. Um, now, I don't even know how close to Durban we are, though. Like, we could be pretty far. Joiner Road. Oh, there we go. Port Shepston is the other direction. So, Port Shepston, I have heard of. Where is it? Port St. John's. Okay, um, well, this is embarrassing. Where is Port Shepston? There, oh, okay. Uh, so Prospectin is, it's gotta be in here somewhere. Prospectin, took me long enough to find this, but um, hopefully we're fine. So we're, I believe, northwest of the uh, highway here. So let's see, maybe it's this road? I don't know. So this is north-south. I definitely went south to get to the road. We have Prospectin Brewery, which is here. Um, okay. So there's like an off-road west. Okay, this is confusing because we don't have much in terms of Oh God, this is actually kind of gross. Let's see. It does okay, so that is that. So we're just in here somewhere. Maybe I'm just supposed to click at the brewery POI, although <clears throat> I guess yeast might just be a reference to like breweries or something. Um, I mean, the road angle fits, like I feel like I just click at the brewery. I don't have anything else that seems better here. So I'm just going to go here and hope that this is what I'm supposed to do. And it is. Good. <laughs> um, a little bit scary, but um, I figured the, the pinpoint was just a little bit too evil if it was anything but that. So good. Solid start. Let's keep it up. We have another north-south road. We have Heineken. Yeah, so it is going to be a, like a brewery map. Um, that um, Ruta 220... Okay, um, I don't know if that's going to help. Macro something, I don't know. Uh, I just feel like one of these should have the city name on it, but I haven't seen it. So we're on Alfonso Reyes. Um, San Nicolas... Wow, how is there not anything that says the city here? Uh, okay, so Alfonso Reyes is the road and it's quite big. Um, 
Quauhtemoc. That's a thing, isn't it? Where is that? That that's fully a city, isn't it? Oh my god. Ciudad Quauhtemoc. Where have I heard of that? Like that's a hot oh there it is. Okay. <clears throat> so we had Alfonso Reyes, which was was it not north south? That's weird. Um in fact, that's very weird. Where are we? Are we not here? Uh-oh. Am I being baited? Nuevo Leon. It's Monterey. What the hell? Okay, I don't know what that was about. Um, now I have to find this, and it's going to be a mess. Uh... Oh my lord. What do I do with this? Alfonso Reyes. Ochtemoc. El Valle. Oh, this is just not going to happen. These. There's way too much crap to scan here. This ever? Does this have a name? This ever? Okay, these roads don't have names. Oh wait, the 220 though, hold on. I forgot about that. Uh, I forgot about it, but I don't know where it is, so. Sick. Um, nice, I, I'm just lost, I'm completely lost. Well, that's too bad. I don't have it. Um, okay. <clears throat> oh. Well, that was awful. Um, Quauhtemoc. It was the name of... Okay. It was the name of the metro station. I thought the label of it looked like it was the name of the city. I, I don't... I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing there. It's not even far from the center. Um, I should have had that, but I just got completely turned around, and I... Didn't help that I was looking in the wrong city for a while. I just don't... Yikes, that just completely turned me around. And then my plonk is really bad, too, because it's... I plonked east of center, and of course it was, like, literally the middle, so... That was not good for several reasons. <laughs> you hate to see it. All right, round three, we have South Korea, which... I cannot stand this country for moving games. I find it just miserably hard to pinpoint. And I miss it almost every time. So, we'll see if that keeps happening. Uh, Sobu? Okay. <clears throat> that doesn't sound very helpful, but maybe it is. I don't know if that's ever a town or something. Oh, nice. I love getting kicked backwards. Okay, well, I guess I am going to go this way. And hope that there is something this way. Uh, I'm realizing this is Jeju because we have, like, all the rock walls and stuff. Um, there's a mountain north, but it's not much of a mountain. I don't know. Is Sobu ever a place? Uh-oh. Um, well, yeah, this looks about as horrible as I would expect, so... Not gonna be searching yet. What's this say? Nothing. Okay. Yeah, this is not looking good. I'll be honest. This is very not looking good. How about this green sign? There we go. Okay, we have... Uh, I can read the sign. We have 11, 20, 11, 36. 11, 36 is here. 11, 20... Okay, so we are... This is a little confusing. I think the 1120 is this one? 1136. And then the 1120. Okay, well... 
It's this, right? Maybe is where we are? Jeju Beer Brewery? I like the sound of that. Um, let me go back and see if this fits. Uh, we have, well, I don't know. I mean, yeah, road angle does fit. It's kind of hard to tell where we are. I don't know if that road would be marked or anything. Uh, something very long. Um, is it just the middle one? I think it's just the middle one because you can go east and then south. Like, I think it's this here, but I hope it's not something else. Jesus. Okay, I was lucky that the POI was really big because otherwise I don't think I ever would have found that. <laughs> um, or I certainly would have been a lot less sure about it. I guess I should have been looking for a brewery in Monterey, but I'm still not sure I would have found it. It's just way too big. Okay, two out of three. That's fine. Glad to bounce back with that round. Let's keep it going. Uh, Mythos Brewery. Okay, this looks like Greece. Got a divided road here. I'll just go east towards the town and see what we can get. But Greece is another country that's really, really tough. So I worry just a bit. Okay, into Gen 4. Um, I don't know why I'm even looking at that. Uh, it's just a bunch of crap. I don't know which way to go. I'm try this way. Um, Thessalonikis. Oh yeah, industrial era of Th Thessaloniki. Okay. Well, I guess that is helpful. We go northeast over a railroad. I don't know if the brewery is going to pop out, or, or the industrial area. Where would that be? Um, how far from the city would that be? It's not going to be like right downtown, but it could be like something out here. Athenian Brewery, imagine. Um, I don't know if that's the one, but I'll keep my pin there for the moment. Is this direction good? I don't know. I'm not sure I like it very much, but... In fact, I'm not sure I like it at all. What does that say? Health center of Diavata. 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 Is that uh, is that a town? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I don't think I'm going to get much more. I'm going to try and line this up. So we have. Basically, it's, it's like west northwest, and it's the Mythos Brewery, Carlsberg Group. This doesn't look bad, does it? This really doesn't look bad. There's another. There's a. Oh, there's a railroad. Here, Olympic Brewery. Be there? Olympic Brew. I mean, it's semi southwest. It doesn't have the same name, but like this intersection makes so much sense with the divided roads and the railroad. I feel like you just have to click here with a brewery over there. Like, where this fits way too well to be wrong. <clears throat> nice. I'm glad I was able to fi find that. That was not obvious. I guess it was it was lucky that I, there happened to be another brewery just hanging out over here, which is why I looked at this area in the first place. But um, not an easy round. I am very okay with that. And then we have okay, that sounds Irish. Ooh, okay. Well, we have the the Dublin car. Although I'm pretty sure I saw this like kind of far from Dublin once, so I don't even know if I. Trust that it's close to Dublin. Close to Luth. Luth is a, definitely a town. Um, right? Luth is this county here, I think? Yeah, already. Okay, yeah. So we really aren't that close to Dublin. So already 19. Uh, 
Uh, let's see. Townstown, Luth, and Knockbridge. Knockbridge is up there. So I guess we're just over here somewhere. Is there a brewery? I don't know. Okay. Um, oh, wait, is there a road number here? Oh, there is. Uh, okay, so it is the R171. Oh, we've got to be in here somewhere then. I um, guess the only question is where. So, oh, this is actually the entry to Dundalk. So, I don't know. Oh my god. Oh my god, he found a brewery called Lions. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Incredible. Incredible. RD Terrace. Um, it is it is this. <laughs> that is fantastic. That is fantastic. A for effort. I like it. <laughs> the Lions Brewery. That's yeah, that's fantastic. Nice. Okay, four out of five is fine. I mean, I definitely screwed up around. I probably shouldn't have screwed up, but again, it's really okay. Um, yeah, the, the, the rest of the rounds were good, and I'm happy with that. Grease pinpoint was difficult, so I'm glad I got that. So, yeah, cool. Good stuff, fun map. And let us move to the Quebec map. No moving Quebec. Five rounds in Quebec. I don't know how I feel about this one. <laughs> so this could be ugly. Um... We'll see what kind of information we're given here, but uh, here we go. Uh, so we have, uh, that I think says Saguenay. Well, it's quite hard to read. Shikutimi. Shikutimi is here, okay. So, there. Okay, I was expecting McDonald's and I did not get one. Uh, okay, well, in that case, uh, I have to figure this out. Okay. Yeah, it's like West Northwest, it's divided. Uh, I don't think we have road names. Au Centre Georges Vézina. That hopefully is helpful. So it's definitely not that road there. Oh, Vézina here. Okay. Good. I guess I could have noticed that the road was curving, but uh, we got there. Uh, it's not a world map, so I have to be a little careful with the pinpointing, but I can't imagine that this is, this has to be good enough, right? Yeah, I think we're basically just right there. Nine meters, that's fine. I'm glad I was able to read that sign. It, I could barely read that it said Saguenay. Without that, it would have been uh, <laughs> a lot harder because I would have assumed that Shikutimi was the place and I would have started like scanning for that and I never would have found it. Um, round two, visitor center, Fort Lennox, Fort Lennox, okay. Sick. Uh, well, I have no clue what that is. So that's fun. Um, there's like an aerial view there. I mean, it's, it's by the water, I guess. It's not a lot of info. That's really all we have here. So I guess I just have to scan for this, but I have no faith in my ability to find this. I don't know if it's more likely that we're close to, like, Ontario, if we have English on this sign, but I'm really not sure that means much. Um, sure. Uh, like, what the heck? Um, there's a lot of water to scan here. I don't really know what to do here. I, I guess I just have to hope that it's, like, big and shows up, but... I don't even know if the St. Lawrence is the place I should be scanning here. Fort Lennox. I mean, I just don't have any idea what that would be. And this seems, well, annoyingly difficult. I don't, I don't know what to do here. I just keep scanning the St. Lawrence or? Um, yeah, this is not great. This is not great. I have no idea where to look here. I shouldn't have scanned the same river twice, probably, but I just am completely lost here, so. 
Yeah, tough. Okay, it is close to um, the US. And completely unfindable? Like completely unfindable? What the heck was I supposed to do there? Did it say Illinois somewhere? Mm, I don't think it did, no. Okay, uh, comments, you're gonna have to tell me what I was supposed to do here because as far as I'm concerned, this round is literally impossible. I have no idea how to do that. Um, unless you like know what Fort Lennox is, but like, why would I know that? That is insane. I mean, there's like, there's too much water in Quebec to scan. There's no way I'm gonna zoom this far in. That's crazy. I'm never finding that. I should have clicked Montreal, I guess, but like, I'm never ever finding that. Okay, 247 Vermont, uh, sure. So I guess we're near Vermont. We have this, yeah, Fitch Bay 14, Georgeville 22. So we're down here somewhere. Okay, it might be pretty difficult to figure out where. Oh, Stansted. Is Stansted here? I guess we really are just down here. Okay, so it's straight east-west. Which is actually kind of weird because these roads aren't really straight east-west, but I... Oh, Stansted is here. Oh, I didn't see that. Um, okay, are we here? We're not on the 247 though, what? Hold on. We're hitting it, are we, what? Oh, but that's the 143, Jesus. Uh, what? Why does this not make sense? Uh, it's literally the 247 that we're hitting, but the 247 is east-west. How is this even real? The road angle is wrong for this. What in the world? Are we up here? What? No, this actually makes no sense. Okay, I don't have this. What in the world? How? How? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> How are we on the 247 if there's a sign for the 247? Huh? Like, these signs show up when you're on off-roads. Like that, oh god, that... I never even considered the possibility we could be on the road. Like, that's, I guess, my fault, but like, I I assumed we had to be on an off-road. That's, Jesus, man. Okay, that was, I think, a skill issue, but this, this never even occurred to me. It's like, why would you have a sign for the 247 if you're already on it? Okay. Jean Rapu, okay, so it's Montreal and we're given that information which means this is gonna suck to pinpoint. Uh, so it's north-south, we have, I don't know if there's water, I guess there's water. There's big city to the west. I don't, like, do I look for the casino? The park? Jean Drapeau is here. Okay, that's lucky that I found that. Um, still might be hard to find. Uh, Jesus, this is rough. I mean, there's like a big port area straight to my west. I don't... Um, this is really hard to... This is really confusing. Um, casino, oh, wait, casino's there. How? Okay. 
one of these roads, but it's not divided or anything. Is it? What in the hell? Uh, yeah, am I just garbage? Or is this actually confusing? Maybe, oh, it, maybe it's this. Oh, okay. Um, so there's a road there, but I can't tell what road that is. What is this pinpoint? Oh, just in front of the building? Maybe it's this building. I, what is going on here? Uh, this is going to have to be my guess here. I, I don't know. Wow, okay. I was not sure that would be right at all. That was not easy at all. <laughs> yeah, okay. I guess I was just thinking we had to be over here with the distances. But no, I mean, that makes perfect sense now in, in hindsight. Um, yeah, I mean, that shouldn't have taken me that long. But at least I got there. Okay, Sijep University. Golden Valley School. Please do not tell me that's all we have. You gotta be kidding me. Uh, what? Okay, really? We have an airport. We have... What? Okay, I, this Sejep thing, is this like... Should I know what that stands for? Because I don't. <laughs> Golden Valley School. How is this all we have? I'm not sure I understand this round. S or no C E G E P. What? I don't understand at all. Okay, um, I guess I'm just not getting this. I don't, I don't understand this round. Um, okay, I, I must be missing something here, but I, I don't get it. So maybe I'll just guess that it's Quebec City or something, because um, they probably have you, Sejep. The Sijep, is that just a generic word? It's probably, surely that's not the right place, but whatever. Golden Valley School, I guess I can just hope that that's here. Which, obviously, it's not going to be, but I, yeah, whatever. Uh, okay, cool, it's Valdor. Um, what? Again, like what? <laughs> what? What am I supposed to do there? Oh, oh, har har, very funny, Golden Valley Valdo. Come on, bro, as if I'm supposed to assume, okay, really? You really expect people to do translations to solve that round? Like, I speak French and I don't solve that, like, what? How is everyone getting that? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you actually kidding me? How did everybody figure that out? Okay, man. Golden. I mean, yes, that's what Val d'Or means, but like, that just does not seem like an obvious jump to me. That seems really. That seems like a quite a stretch. Uh, and then that also also that Fort Lennox thing. No idea what that was supposed to be. So that map was awful for me. Um, <laughs> it seemed probably. It honestly seemed like the hardest map of the entire season so far in terms of solvability. Like. I guess it was solvable, but a couple of those rounds felt really, really tough to me. But maybe that's just my fault. Um, but those were kind of nasty. So, yeah, that might be my worst map of the season uh, in comparison to the rest of the people playing. So that's not great. Uh, this map seems pretty easy, so hopefully we can do well with that. Because, um, yeah, that last map was not amazing. 
Ville de Brignol, I think that says. I don't know. Um, but we do have plenty of good stuff over here. Toulon is there. Brignol, okay. Collège Jean Moulin. Uh, we have a massive roundabout, which should help. Could be that. Could be that. What else? What do we have here? Gémeau. So it is this, right? Bonaval. Yeah, this is correct, I think. McDonald's there. Yeah, okay. Cool. Straightforward first round. I'll take it. Round two. Looks like E45 and something 63. And a ugh, Vesterboden bus stop, maybe. Uh, it's E45 here. It is. I'm not positive about the bus stop, but hopefully with a ferry stella and something 63. Um, okay, this could be hard though. Where's. 363. Um, do we have that town to the to the west? I don't know, but I, I mean this seems to work. Oh wait, it's the same road though, hold on. So it's north south. It's really just straight north south here. Where's this Ferry Stella place? Oh, 363 is there too. There? Uh, it might be here. A oh, source of, it says that there. Okay. Uh, I guess I have to assume it's this intersection. There's a, yeah, the, because there's a, yeah, there's a road east, which is like, there's only one place with a road east over the railroad um so this should be correct it took me a second but we're there and three is ontario with that okay okay lulac is here nipigon i'd say we're roughly like there-ish um Oh, we have the 11 and the 631 comes off south. 631 is somewhere here. Okay. Pretty close to the intersection, I think. With world map scoring, this shouldn't be too scary. Just click a little bit west of it, and I'm sure it will be fine. Okay, <clears throat> round four, massive pull. It is Sri Lanka. We have Manar, Jaffna. Okay, Manar is there. A14, A32. 14 is here. 32 is there. So that would put us around here. Thaladi, that's that is what we have here. Off road is uh, maybe that over there. So we'd be up here, kind of at the north end of the buildings. And round number five, this is Madagascar. This is Ambanja, I think. Um. Which would put us right about there. Okay, well that wasn't so bad. <laughs> Definitely was uh, on the easier side as maps go. Uh, nice. Again, pretty easy, but like, I, I can't complain. It's a nice confidence booster after the last map because that was really, really tricky. So yeah, fun map. I mean, maybe a little too easy, but fun nonetheless. And now the NMPZ, which is always the most random, but um, 
alpine. So I don't know if it's just going to be a bunch of pine trees. I guess we'll find out, but uh, this could be tricky. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, it will be tricky. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Okay, well, it's Mediterranean, I guess. Um, I could see this being... Uh, oof. Um, well, I could see Greece, I could see Turkey, I could see Israel. I don't know if 21... Does 21 copyright work for Israel? I don't know when they were actually driving. Um, it could be Israel. I don't... I feel like it's too risky to guess Israel. I probably will guess Turkey or Greece. If Turkey, surely West, I think. Um, no idea how to tell between Turkey and Greece here or any other country, really, but... I mean, this is a hard round. I, I think I just go... West Turkey and hope for the best. Wow, what? How is that there? Really? Um, Israel, I guess, might have even been better. That is honestly surprising. I thought that looked really Western. Um, whoops. Okay, well, not the best guess I've ever made, but uh, <laughs> tough. Uh, this will be Japan, although, again, like, there's really nothing to use here. Like, I don't know... I don't know what to do with a round like this. There's no, there's not really any usable clues. So I can just click middle, which is presumably what everyone's gonna do. But I'm not really getting any vibes from this. <gasps> is that cabbage? Is that cabbage right above the map? Oh my God. Is it actually? No, what the hell? What the hell? You gotta go for it, right? Trust the cabbage, trust the cabbage. I believe in the cabbage. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what is that plonk as well? <laughs> oh, I was about to send Nagano, thank goodness. Thank goodness I saw the cabbage. Nine kilometers, let's go. Holy moly. Uh, okay, well, back to whatever this is. Uh, this looks like Europe again. I guess I would think Spain or, uh, France, Portugal, something like that. I don't know. This is really weird. The vegetation is kind of strange. I really have no idea what to do with this. Uh... This is really hard. Yeah, I got nothing. I'm just click here. What the? Oh my god. Okay, Blinky. Blinky, excuse me? <laughs> what? <laughs> how? How do you how do you know that? How does he know this road? <laughs> How is that even possible? Oh no. Um, okay, so apparently I'm trash. Um, I guess that's why the vegetation looked weird, is because it's not Spain at all. It's not even close to Spain. I guess that hill, that sort of barren look, is much more UK than than like Spain. I guess in Spain you'd have like trees on the hills or something, but it's just such weird coverage. I didn't even have any idea where to go that was that was that was a bad guess <laughs> that was definitely a bad guess but I guess I made up for it with the Japan round so whoa whoa this is like whoa this looks wow this looks familiar um I mean I, I might not be here but my god it feels like here East West. Do I do it? I feel like I, I feel like I gotta do this. Um, it's not. It feels kind of like. No, I, I'm trying to see if I know the road. It, 
I don't think it's the 80. Could it? No, I don't think this is right, no, but. <laughs> I gotta try it, right? Oh, yes, dude, yes. Yes, let's go. <laughs> nice, okay, I definitely did not know the road. It was, I have not even, I have not been wherever the hell this is, but I've driven past it many times. Um, nice, okay, well, that was fortunate. I mean, it didn't have to be there. I mean, there's a lot of, like, the pine forests pretty much all throughout this area, even up into, like, Oregon and stuff, look kind of exactly like that, so that really could have been anything. But I just thought it looked so much like Tahoe. I have to guess Tahoe. And it worked. Final round. So we went bad round, good round, bad round, good round. So I guess it's time for a bad round. Which seems about right, because uh, what the heck am I looking at? Hmm. <laughs> Seriously, what am I looking at here? I... Could this ever be Bhutan? I've never seen a road like this in Bhutan. I feel like that's a terrible guess. I feel like if Bhutan had a road like this, I would have seen it. The vegetation works, but... No, I don't think I ever go Bhutan here. It, fe it just feels wrong. Or does it? Oh, I'm caught in two mines here. This is vegetation. What if it's Mongolia? No way, right? I'm gonna go Bhutan. No! 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 That's where I was gonna go, dude! Oh my god! Oh my god! That was like the other thing in my head. Are you kidding me? I was like, it looks like Indo. That was, that was literally the other thing in my head. That's so annoying. Oh my god. That's actually devastating. Okay, I mean, my score is honestly not bad. I think we probably had a few people guess Bhutan there. Um, or other places. It, it just, like, the road was wrong for Bhutan, but I just had no idea what to do there. Dang it, man. I was really considering Indonesia there. I really was. And I probably would have gone Java, so that's, ah, that's annoying. Okay, Turkey round was weird. I think... My score there is probably at least okay. I should have, maybe I should have hedged more central, but I, I was worried it was gonna be Greece too. So I think my guess was fine. Um, obviously the Japan and, and Tahoe guesses, I might be like top guess on both of those rounds. It's certainly close. Lee Bayou was a little closer, but I couldn't have done much better on rounds two and four. Um, round three was, really rough. <laughs> no one was as far away as me on round three, at least in the top 25. So that was just a massive skill issue, seeing that seeing that hill and thinking it was Spain. But uh, oh well. Um, so that was um, hmm. that was something. That map was, was certainly something. I think my round per round score is not amazing because I just had a few bad guesses, but Eh, it wasn't terrible. It still feels like it might have been better than the Quebec map. That that map was just really ugly for me. So it was an interesting week. Probably the rockiest one so far, and I would guess that I'm the lowest um, in overall score of all the weeks that I've played so far. But who knows? Um, I guess we'll find out in a second because I should be able to update the sheet. So I'll get back to you when I do that. Okay, as expected, this was my worst week so far, and it was actually my worst week by quite a bit. Um, the Quebec map was ugly, as expected. Um, 55th overall on that one. Honestly, the NMPZ was fine, the first map was fine, but yeah, the Quebec one I think really hurt me um, overall. Definitely put me down in the rank uh, the rankings. But um, yeah, still a good time, of course. Um, fun maps. Quebec was definitely, I think, it felt to me like the hardest map so far, but maybe... Maybe I'm just bad because <laughs> clearly other people were okay with it. Um, but fun maps overall, as always. And I guess I'll see you very soon for a quick little recap of the week. All right, we are back for a quick recap of week number five. So I did end up finishing 19th on the week out of uh, 169 players. 
Congratulations to everybody who played, and thank you for playing. And congratulations to Simon Goose, Nils, and Mr. Swiss Snow for being the top three players in week number five. The overall standings look like this. There are a few players who have played uh, week six, but I believe I'm fourth um, because you have these three on five weeks, and then I am fourth out of the people who have played five. So fourth overall, uh, halfway through the season, I'm pretty happy with. Um, I think maybe top three would be a fun... Um, aim to go for uh, for the entire season, but it's obviously going to be tricky to pull off. But yeah, thanks as always to the Mappers for another great week, and I will see you all very soon in week number six for another video. See you then.